Simmons, what's up? This is Arcade from 360 Reader. Right now, I'm going to talk about the best tips and tricks to fix AirPlay to Mac not working issue. For those unfamiliar with AirPlay to Mac, your Mac can share, play and present content from other AirPlay supported devices such as your iPhone and iPad. This all new feature has arrived in Mac OS Monterey and iOS 15 and iPad OS 15. A number of iPhone and iPad users have reported that they can't AirPlay content to their Mac if the problem has hit your device as well. This Pro tips can help you fix the issue. That all being said, let's dive right in. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. The very first thing that you should check out is to ensure that your Mac is compatible for AirPlay to Mac feature. Here is the list of all the Macs that support AirPlay to Mac feature. MacBook Pro 2018 and later, MacBook Air 2018 and later, iMac 2019 and later, iMac Pro 2017 and later, Mac Mini 2020 and later, and Mac Pro 2019 or later. At the same time, you must also ensure that your iPhone and iPad are compatible for AirPlay to Mac feature because not all the iOS 15 and iPad OS 15 devices are compatible for AirPlay to Mac feature. Here is the list of all the iPhone and iPad models that support AirPlay to Mac feature. iPhone 7 and later, iPad Pro 2nd generation and later, iPad Air 3rd generation and later, iPad 6th generation and later, and iPad Mini 5th generation and later. It's worth pointing out that older iPhone, iPad and Mac models may share content at a lower resolution to supported Mac models when allow AirPlay for a set to everyone or anyone on the same network in sharing preferences. Next up, make sure both your iPhone and Mac are connected with the same iCloud account. Head over to the Settings app on your iPhone or iPad, then tap on the Apple ID banner located at the top, and then check out the Apple ID. On your Mac, launch System Preferences, and then click on Apple ID. After that, check out the iCloud account located under your profile. Up next, make sure both your iPhone and Mac are connected with the same Wi-Fi network. Head over to the Wi-Fi settings on your iPhone and iPad to check the Wi-Fi network. And on your Mac, click on the Wi-Fi menu located at the top right corner of the screen to check the Wi-Fi network. If you still can't airplay content to your Mac, then I would recommend you to allow everyone to airplay content to your Mac OS device. To get it done, simply launch System Preferences on your Mac and then select Sharing. After that, make sure to check the box to the left of the airplay receiver. In the Allow Airplay for section, there are three options to choose from. I would recommend you to select Everyone. It allows you to let everyone airplay content to your Mac without any roadblock. Now I would recommend you to restart both your iPhone and Mac and then try to airplay content to your Mac. In the supported app, you can simply tap on the streaming icon or the airplay button and then choose your Mac under speakers and TV section. If you want to mirror the display of your iPhone or iPad, simply swipe down from the top right corner of the screen or simply swipe up from the bottom of the display to access control center and then tap on the screen mirroring. After that, choose the Mac you would like to airplay to. If the problem continues, then I would suggest you to sign out of iCloud account both on your iPhone and Mac and then sign back in. On your iPhone and iPad launch settings app, then tap on the Apple ID banner, then scroll down and then tap on sign out. After that, follow the instructions to sign out of your account. Now wait for some time and then sign back in. On your Mac, launch system preferences and then click on Apple ID. After that, click on overview in the sidebar and then hit sign out and then follow the instructions to sign out of your account. After that, sign back in. 
If none of the tricks has worked in fixing the AirPlay to Mac feature, then I would suggest you to update both your iPhone and Mac because the problem could be due to a software bug. And in this case, updating the software is the best way to go. On your iPhone and iPad, launch the Settings app and then tap on General. After that, tap on Software Update and then download and install the latest version of iOS or iPad OS. On your Mac, launch System Preferences and then click on Software Update. After that, download and install the latest version of macOS on your Mac. That's all there is to it. Hopefully, you have been able to fix the problem and now you can airplay content from your iPhone and iPad to your Mac. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such helpful tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.